So technically what happened, I was playing games on my tablet and then I heard the fire alarm and I smelled smoke. So I went downstairs and checked it and then I told my Lula to um, go downstairs, I mean go outside and then she went, she didn't listen and then she went downstairs and then I ran to the telephone and got it and go outside and then I went to go call the police and then when I was calling the police, she came out. He was like, mom, the house is on fire and I couldn't really process it. It's not something that you would typically hear every day, especially just leaving like 30 minutes later and then I come back and the house is on fire. All I can think about was like, oh my gosh, is everyone okay? Did my grandparents get out safe? And then my neighbor sent me a picture of the house and I was just like rushing to get to him. And then when I came, um, my grandparents were already in the ambulance. But our neighbor was, he played a big part of this, part of the role too, was saving him because he could hear him yelling already. Um, but he just went into the house. I think he put on like a mask and then went underneath the fire and then got him out. I'm just happy that he was able to respond in that type of way with that kind of situation. Like honestly, if that was me, like I'd probably, I'd probably like panic and faint or something. But he, he kept his cool and he did the right steps. Like I think it's very important for kids to know like the address, um, just in case if anything happens and just to remain calm in those type of situations because if you're not then things can get worse.